everybody, welcome back. Today I have the lovely Michelle again, one of my besties. <laughs> Hi and guys. And we have filmed a really chatty get ready with us. So it's got a bit of bronze skin, a bit of a, a glowy cheekbone, a bold lip. Today we are playing with a new lipstick range. These are the brand new Rimmel The Only One Matte Lipsticks. Uh, so they had the one satins out for about a year. Now they've got the matte lipsticks. They look very matte, but they don't feel matte. They're actually um, so comfortable on the lips. Yeah. They have like emollients in the formula so it doesn't dry you out. It's definitely like a new kind of formula for anyone who's so sick of super drying matte lipsticks. It is a very unique formula. So we're going to be playing with those today. This one's a chatty one so feel free to just put your phone down and get chill ready. Out. Yeah, chill get out. snack. Yeah, <laughs> get, uh, get ready with us. And uh, make sure you go to Michelle's channel, subscribe and see the video that we filmed for her channel. Um, yeah. Cue. So I'm going to use the Clinique Super Balanced Silk Foundation. Really like this one and it's a really good color for fake tanning. So this is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Water Foundation. Everyone's talking about this. Yeah, it is. It's really nice. I mean, people are saying it's full coverage. I don't, I'm not sure if I agree with that. To me, it's kind of like a, a nice sheer to medium, but it looks very skin like. It looks like skin. I often think that when people refer to a full coverage foundation, um, I, I kind of have a little bit of a laugh because it's usually girls without pigmentation or without acne or without like mm. scarring that are saying it's full coverage. If I was to put it on like my freckles and my pigmentation would still show through. Yeah. To me, full coverage means nothing coming through. Like Kevin Aquan Central Skin Enhancer. Oh, that that's, stuff. That's is... the benchmark. That's a that's like a that's a full coverage. A nine point five ten in coverage, right? Yeah. What I like about this foundation is that it's a nice medium coverage. Yeah. But it's still really light. Did you like two thousand sixteen? Because I feel like nobody liked two thousand sixteen. I... I don't remember most of it. I came up with like a catchphrase in the end for 2016 because every time I was just like, oh, here's all these problems going on in my life. Let's deal with the next one. So at the end, I just started going, just throw it on the pile. <laughs> just, just throw it on top of the pile. Yeah. How good is this brush? I love it. This is one of my all-time favorite brushes. Thank you so much for saying that because I use it so much, I'm kind of a bit ashamed of it. No, <laughs> Because no, it's no. so manky and janky. Okay, well, I just want to quickly show them this is the um, It Cosmetics Double Ended Doesn't Have a Name Brush. It's really hard when you're trying to fill out description boxes. Yeah. Every day I will do my foundation with this. I'll blend in my cream bronzer, my cream blush, and my and then Blender, my blender concealer. And I'm just like, what is this brush? Yeah. I don't like the Born This Way. <laughs> I thought I did to begin with, but it's just. I kind of blend it out and then it's gone. Everyone lost their minds over NARS Creamy Concealer, over um, Urban Decay Naked, Naked over um, Born This Way, over everything. The only one I've ever agreed with fully is MAC Pro Longwear. Everything else I'm like, am I, I missing something? Or is yeah. it because I'm older than everyone? So, like, oh, shoo shop. No, but seriously. Look, I'm gonna use a bit of a erase paste. Very brightening though. It is a good product for color correcting. It's so brightening, erase paste. Mm. For <laughs> brightening. You're so Australian there. <laughs> oh my god, it's so brightening. <laughs> that is a perfect depiction of how I sound. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna just do a little bit of highlighting, but it's a similar, it's not too light for my foundation, this um, shade. I just really like Pro Longwear more than anything for my eyelids. I'm just gonna use some Kevin Aquan Sensual Skin Enhancer for the giant. Brett! No, this is a Fred. He's been living on my chin for quite a while. So for this look, we're going for quite a dewy natural base, so maybe a cream? Yeah, I'm going to cream bronze. And I'm not um, contouring with this, by the way. I'm using it as a cream bronzer and just for a bit of kind of sculptage. I'm just oh, gonna... I just love it. I use this every freaking day. Can I borrow some of that? Yeah, it's lovely. Okay. Curvy contour. Let's do this. Oh, that's in your hair, mate. You literally oh. just drew it. Look at it. You just drew it into your hair. Oh, I couldn't see. <laughs> like, like, I, I was like, minimal makeup. So yeah. nice. So nice. <laughs> Let's do highlight. I'm going to use the Marc Jacobs Spotlight Glow Stick. I really like this. So, kind of fingers, then Beauty Blender. Okay. If you want to try. So, because we're doing bronzy, are we glow glowy? Yeah. yeah, we want glowy, bronzy. Every time I think I want bronzy, I think of Becca ads. It's just hyper healthy looking. Like Yeah. Oh, no, that is really nice. Beautiful. Yeah, it is really nice. I think it's just, it's a product that you, you've got to apply carefully. Yeah. I would like... Yeah. 
to know you, baby. Like to get under your sexy body. Am I yeah. blended fully? Yeah, you're blended. You look so blended. Blendiest of all the blends. You are the blendiest of all Girl. the blends. Do you want to do some powder? Yeah, I'm going to powder. Tell me, what do you think about this? I really like it. I don't think I like it. And I feel really? like the only person actually who doesn't like it. Sometimes if I'm dehydrated, I get real crepey with it and stuff. But 90% of the time it looks good. Okay. I think I'm just going to stick with my Rouge Bunny Rouge powder because I know that, that delivers. So you, are you setting your entire face or? I'm just setting. I set my eyelids under my eyes down to the sides of my nose, my top lip and my chin. Ditto. I would like to get... To know you, baby, like to get under your sexy body. You guys, Michelle taught me today how to curl my hair, and actually, it was like there was like a new, <laughs> new like path paved in my brain, and I get it now. I just get it, and my hands get it, and my brain and my hand they work together. It's amazing. <laughs> For me, I was making a few really common errors. It was things I didn't know I did differently until I saw you doing, doing them. it wrong. <laughs> yeah, doing it wrong. And then I was like, oh, that's why this isn't working out for her. Yeah. Okay, so I'm using uh, the Holika, Holika Wonder Drawing Skinny Eyebrow. Mm. Bought this in Korea and it's very, very grey and I like it a lot. Love grey eye products. Yeah. I'm using Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in Taupe. I love when you have your brows tinted and you're just filling them in. It takes two seconds. You're just like, it makes life so easy. But I, I think, love your brows. I love them. Why though? They are just so beautiful. I love the color. I love the shape. Yeah. I, if I could take your brows and put them on my face, I would. Really? Yeah. Oh, girl. Yeah. I'm just going to set my brows with the Benefit Gimme Brow in shade one. Very ashy. Love this product. How are you finishing your brows? And I've only done one. Because my brows are very asymmetrical. So I'm, I'm constantly oh, like... They, mine are not... Twins. Mine aren't even neighbors. No, 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 they don't. Mine, one lives in Russia and one lives in Fiji. <laughs> Personal space doesn't exist with your best friends. Mm -mm. Look how, look at the texture from this. Oh, so much texture. And you gotta, you gotta frown when you do this. Otherwise, it doesn't yeah. work. For my eyes, I'm just gonna go in with the Stila Eyes of the Window palette in the shade Spirit, and I'm just gonna use like this color here to do a bit of definition in the crease and cross my lid but we're not really going crazy with eyes yeah, today. Yeah I think we'll do something just really kind of natural and neutral on the eyes. Yep. Natural. Recently I've been wearing less and less eye makeup in my day to day. Me too. Yeah I'm, I'm really enjoying the simplicity actually. Mm. I'm going to use the, what is this, the Tartus Pro palette. This is actually really nice um, and again just one of those really neutral contoury kind of shades. I, I do feel like makeup is getting kind of very ruley again. It was at the beginning and then right, we had wrong, this- Right, wrong, right, wrong, yeah. right, wrong. There's no right and wrong. There's sloppy application. Yeah, that's what there's, I mean. In makeup, there's sloppy application, but I just don't believe in, in bad makeup. And I don't even believe in bad makeup product, to be honest, like, cause everything is someone's preference, like. True. I'm just going to add a tiny bit of shimmer. Gonna add some shimmer? Yeah, I'm gonna use the Stila Kitten. Just nice. The, just in the inner corner, you know. Just a little something, something. A little something, something. Just so pretty. So nice. So nice. So nice. <laughs> so nice. Oh so God. nice. Oh my God. You actually don't even have that strong an accent. It's just funny. I'm just going to smoke out my lower lash line a little because I think that's nice on a, on a hooded kind of heavy eyelid, hooded eyelid kind of shape. Mm. Maybe like this one a little on the lid. Just mm. Do can it. Can you see that? Oh, nice. Do, 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 do. Going on the Lancome train with mascaras. I'm gonna use Grandiose. I'm using Hypnos Drama. Haven't tried this in a while. I thought I'd give it a go. I messed up the curl on this eye and I'm just so upset now. <laughs> you friend. have really nice lashes. Are you coming on to me? Yes. Shall I like your brows? I like I your lashes. lashes. <laughs> so today we're playing with a new range of lipsticks. Now you might be familiar with the Rimmel The Only One lipsticks. These are a satin lipstick that I think they launched um, last year. Yeah. And they've actually come out with a whole bunch of new shades. So these are all nudes, by the way. Great. Love a good nude. Love a good nude. <laughs> I'm so, so predictable. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, my favorite one is actually Ain't No Other, which is the number 760. And this is more of like that kind of 
peachy pinky undertone, yes. which is very typical of me as well. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. But today we're going to be applying the Rimmel The Only One Matte Lipsticks. They come in a bunch of really cool colors. So you've got a good nude, you've got a vamp, you've got some uh, brighter shades. They are very, very comfortable. So they absolutely look matte but they feel like a satin. They feel very similar to the, on the lips as the satins do. So very comfortable. If you're over the whole matte liquid lip trend. Oh my God, I'm so over it. Yeah. They just make me feel like, like chalky crumbly. and crumbly. Yeah. Whereas these ones, you still feel that smoothness and that moving in your yeah. lips, but they look uber matte. They look very matte, but they feel cushiony. I would say cushiony on the lips, mm. very comfortable. So today I'm going to be wearing the shade 110, which is one of my faves. It's kind of like a, a pink. It's a pale but bright pink. That's how I'd describe it. For sure. And I'm going to go in with the shade 120 called The Shots. I really like that name. And this is a really vibrant, like, it's a, a coral pink. Yeah. So it's a very, uh, it's a deep, bright, warm pink. <laughs> what she said. Oh, I love this. Oh, yeah. So this has got a bit of that white base in it, so it really stands apart from the face. It's a very, very much a statement lip. Mm. And when I have a bit of bronze going on, I love this kind of shade. And I really like how they're actually the shape of the bullet because you can really kind of draw along that lip line. That's a beautiful color on you. I really like that. Thank you. It just makes my eyes go like, whoop -pam! Yes. Because that is a word, by the way. Whoop -pam! Uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> in the dictionary, what pen? Mm. Yeah. Do you want to put on a blush? I'm going to put on a bit of blush, yeah. But okay. this one is one of my absolute faves. It's from Tarte. It's the Amazonian clay blush, blush in the shade Exposed. It's a really nothing color. Yeah. So it adds a bit of color to the cheeks, but it's almost more bronzy than it is blushy. Yeah. Exposed is one of those good ones if you're wearing a bright lip and you just don't know what blush to wear. It oh, because you don't know everything. what color is to put with it. Exactly. Yeah. So if you see that. It just works. It's there, but it's not there. Yeah. I find I have a face that does need a bit of blush. Whereas it's overpowering on your face. Can you, do, do you, like, okay, look at me right now. Do you think I need blush? I don't, no. Yeah. I feel like I want more highlight, but I'm gonna step back. Oh, can I show you a highlight? Have you tried it, the Stiller one? No, this is the one you were telling me about the other oh, night. Oh, get, get, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Highlighting is just like what I live for. You guys remember <laughs> this, yeah? I showed this um, in my New Year's Eve tutorial. Gimme, give gimme give some of this. Okay. Oh, yeah. This mm. is limited edition, unfortunately. I don't know if I could get carried away with this. You know, Michelle loves the highlighter when she gets all weird in the voice. Yeah. You know, people who are over the highlight right now are like, stop. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't. So I'm not over it yet. Ow, ow. And then with this kind of makeup as well, that beachy wave, it's just the perfect yeah. combo. <laughs> and then it goes. <laughs> really hope that you guys enjoyed that video. If you haven't already subscribed to Michelle, go and subscribe to her channel. She's one of my besties. Make sure you that you, make sure you that no. red, 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 red. <laughs> make sure that you check out the video that we filmed for Michelle's channel. I will have that linked in the description box. I hope you have a wonderful day and I, we, We'll speak to you very soon. We I. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Disco, disco, disco tech, disco tech, disco tech. Blend check, blend check. Like a microwave. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Burr. Bing. To know you, baby. Like to get under your sexy body.